What's going on fam? We are here today to test the validity of a statement I actually saw on Facebook saying that Coca-Cola cleans rust off of tools. And basically the way they advertised it was like, take these old pair of rusty pliers, stick them in that Coke for four to six hours, then pull them out and you've got brand new pliers. When I saw that I was like, what? Highly suspect if you ask me. And the point they were trying to make in the video was, if Coke can do this to rust on pliers, imagine what it does to your stomach. Okay, obviously my first thought is, if you have Coke sitting in your stomach for four to six hours, you have problems and you probably need to see a professional. But you know what, we're gonna test it ourselves anyway. I'm gonna stick these old pair of rusty pliers in Coca-Cola overnight and we're gonna see if the Coke actually eats the rust off of the pliers. All right, so haters won't say it's fake. I've got real Coca-Cola. What a waste of good Coke, but we're gonna fill that puppy right up there. As you can see, we have our old pair of rusty pliers going right into the Coca-Cola. You can see it's fully submerged and we are gonna leave it. And we will be back in the morning to find out if this is fact or fiction. Here we go. It has been overnight, about 15 hours later. There better not be any rust on these pliers. It better just have melted away according to the ad. So let's take a look. Moment of truth. Does Coke clean rust off of tools? Epic fail. All right, so here's what are my old rusty pliers look like after soaking for 15 hours in this Coca-Cola. And this is what they should have looked like. Guys, myth busted. All right, but we're not done yet. I am still going to try to scrub these pliers off that have been sitting in that Coke for all this time with a wire brush. And we'll see if the Coke did actually break any of that rust down. Come off there, you little bugger. All right, so this is what the pliers look like now after about five minutes of hard scrubbing with that wire brush. So uh, yeah, that's the other side. So in comparison, you can see, yeah, it looks a little better, but I don't know if the Coca-Cola actually broke that down. I mean, the way it was advertised, this should have been squeaky clean. So I am not impressed. So all I can surmise from this test is this was just some made up facts, probably thought up by some green juice drinking hippies that don't want you to enjoy the good things in life because they get some weird sense of superiority from drinking kale shakes and eating grass sandwiches. Misery does love company. So y'all have fun eating your grass and smoking it apparently. But as for me, I'm gonna continue to pleasure my taste buds on this classic American beverage.